Okay, part two on the way. Now we're in the river. Mm -hmm. We're gonna put that on. We're gonna put that on her. We're gonna put running shoes and sprint shoes on you. We're gonna do that. Okay. A bit low on magic and stuff, but whatever. Here we go, this rift will take us to Narsh. So that little minor thing is uh, what you skip by saying no three times, which is the reason why they do it. But. Um, as you may have noticed... Uh, Zell can use Runic regardless of what he's equipped with. Well, he actually has a sword right now, so it's probably not too surprising. There, now I've got that set up, so... I'm probably going to do a few rounds on the river just to uh, mostly to get a bit of money since uh, I need to purchase throwing items. Um, blind supposedly works now. I haven't seen it make a huge lot of difference though. I think they fixed evade and thought that blind was linked to that, but I think it's actually separate because I still haven't seen a lot of misses from blind people. Well, there was a miss, so maybe it does. But things will miss normally now, too, so... It isn't as bad as it is in a lot of games, so... Okay, I think that's enough. River grinding. You get a lot of money from those guys. Ooh, this is bad. Um, if I got any good magic now, Vanish. Especially since the Vanish Doom doesn't work, that's pretty bad. I guess I could banish the party and... How about you, Imp? No attack spells whatsoever, usually that's all they give them. Yeah, they are missing a little bit, but not that much. Still with Bannon on us, we'll stay alive. Oh, they're dropping shurikens. Wonder if I've collected a few. Let's see, I have five eye drops. Two shurikens, that's all. Well, I can use them to throw it. Uh, let's see. I could also have either of them cast Remedy, but I'll save that in my sleeping bags. What? What is it? Game over. Don't tease the octopus, kids. Okay, let's go ahead and throw our shurikens. Whack, whack. Delicious morsel. Let me get my bib. Ouch. Not too bad. Okay. We're going to start uh, as usual. Let's sell. Um, he got a full heal, luckily. Okay, we're going to go ahead and uh, pick up Shadow here, who also has Go-Go's look. 
Amar, and I overwrote whatever it was. Who on earth is Amarn? Amarnie? I'm gonna call you Amarnie just because. Okay, Amarnie, what skill do you have? Uh, sketch, of course. And once again, high vigor, low everything else. Well, what equipment can you use? Forged headband. Crystal shield is as weak as shield. That is hilarious. I am so tearing apart your equipment. It's not the first time that's happened. Okay, so he has sketch, which is pretty much useless. Unless he can sketch glitch, which there is no sketch glitch here, of course. Sometimes he can have something good. Kodachi. Wow. I'll get two Kodachis, just in case I need it. Uh, crossbow soft, sprint shoes, the clear soft, dried meat. I, no, I probably don't need those because he's a healer. So I'll have to be a healer. Okay. 12, 114. Okay, well, we'll, we'll do some combat damage. Ooh, ha. I'm saving just in case Shadow decides to take a walk. I'm gonna need him. I want to tear off his equipment for this. I've never actually had Shadow leave in the middle of uh, this first journey, even when fighting normally like this, but there's always the first chance for the first time. Haha, uh -huh, he's got Edgar's look. Marcus. Okay, Marcus. Let's see how good you are. Rage. He uses rages. This will be interesting. Low speed, but really high magic power. He can finally use the full moon. And gold shield is his worst shield. Okay, well... Let's see what random rages he has. Ing. Really an ing, gobbler, popper, specter, first glass. Life shaver. Oh, he's keeping himself healed. Mystery Veil. Oh wow, that's actually really nice. Oh, Yellow Shadow is so ugly. Okay, first of all, chest in here to grab. Hit it, and you'll avoid the fight with the dog. Oh, and then you can open it. Ninja Gear, that's good. Can you use... no. Oh, you need to equip the Metro Best. Can't use Ninja Gear either, though. You can use the Mystery Veil. And the Ninja Gear. Can't use the Hitband though. I'll need to learn to take that off for somebody else though. Okay, now we ignore him and come into this wood cut. Regal Cutlass Tincture. Regal Cutlass is a would be weapon. Only tag power 54 can only be used by Gogo. -Go. What a pathetic excuse for it. Way to the cells. Do I look like a waiter? The 
green kind of looks appropriate for him, but in some ways it's covering his Edgar's green is pretty bad. Shoes later. It's actually not bad because this attack is so much higher. Stone sometimes does a lot of damage and sometimes it's useless. So site is probably the most reliable. Green cherry. Something moderately useful. Oop seven starts learning some handy magic soon. Okay, no chance of losing a shadow. Um, the ghost never has anything worth get talking, so I'm not going to talk to any of the ghosts. And really, only one chest worth looting here. The one will always summon Siegfried. So it doesn't work doing anything with the interceptor. Okay, let's see what's in this nice chest. Black belt. Well, actually. Black belt would be okay for you. Nothing or anything in any of these cars. So no. Let's 
save point. I already got saved earlier. I don't know what. Alas, I cannot suplex the train because I have no blitzer to suplex, so. Catch the train and find out what happens. <laughs> that was funny. Okay, do I have... I need to use my only phoenix down, sadly. Okay. Oh, another pursuit ninja gear. Oh, Bible thump signs. Wife and child are gone. Oh, we can equip the assassin. He's an idiot this time. Could have had the assassin instead. I'm still been sketching. Oh, I'm about to get rid of him. Okay, now... It pays better than the full moon, huh? Interesting. Okay, well... Crystal Shield's good. Tough. Now, Gal, what do you look like? You look like yourself. Minwoo! Minwoo! Okay, Minwoo the Gal. We'll see what skills you have in a minute. Now, as I said, you don't actually need uh, dried meat this time. Uh, the other thing is, whoever has the rage ability picks up rages just by fighting on the belt. You don't have to do any of the stupid leaping stuff, which is nice. So I should grind a little bit here. Sadly, I can't grind for experience, but I can grind for excellent. These are some of my favorite abilities for Templar, so go. Wow! Wow! Oh, I'm Minwoo! I'm your friend! Let's travel together! Yay! Okay, so Minwoo, how awesome are you? You are... Flippin' Berserker. Which isn't so bad. Except that once again, you have decent- you have the best magic power I've seen yet on anybody. But you have no speed! Why does everybody have no speed? Ooh, we can use the Mystery Veil though, that's good. Nobody could use any of the items I've got. Ah, uh, so annoying. Oh well, well, he'll be a powerful Berserk. I have a couple powerful Berserkers now. I have Templar, that's all I need really for now. I have a lot of middle-of-the-road guys, mostly. Oh, I don't really need to do this. Okay, um... Maybe I'll buy some more fire skins for Shadow, just because... No Phoenix Downs, which is what I really want. Okay, time to get a tin tin bar. 
This is uh, one of the side quests that's always skipped. This wounded soldier is from Mount Miranda. The Empire invaded me and joined the army. He ran away. They injured him and he winded up here in Mobiliz. He has a girlfriend back in uh, Miranda that he writes to named Lola. But uh, the thing is, of course, that because he's laid up in bed, he can't even pick her up in. So we send letters on his behalf at the mail post here. Send it. Wall ring. Ooh, that's kind of nice. Mostly just for selling, but... Now... Normally you have to sleep for time to pass, or you can talk to this guy. So now we come back into the soldier's home. Here's a letter for us to read to him again. I'm not sure what it says, I really don't care. I'm just doing this <laughs> side quest. You can send a record for 500 gold. Then we talk to this guy. Come back in here. Oh look, another letter's arrived. It takes him a long time to read to us. Let's take an ale. If only we had some tonic. Okay. Even though we've written and said so many things she hasn't heard from him. I said you were reading a book, if only I could read it too. You don't actually have to talk to him either, <laughs> just send it. So, uh, if you've seen portions of the game, in my name you send Lola many things. I wish to thank you. Please accept this as a token of my appreciation. Tintinabar. It's a sad thing you can't move, because Tintinabar is a relic that heals you for every step you take. So, if he could move, he would get healed in no time. But, uh, if you've seen the end of the game when you recruit Cyan, like in 100% speedruns or something like the one I did, you may have wondered what that was about with Lola and uh, Cyan and... This is Mobiliz, and there's a uh, wounded soldiers in Mobiliz, but during the uh, Mithril Pike doesn't seem to be all that good. Imperial isn't really that good either, so no weapons are any good. But uh, because all of the soldiers perish in the uh, war. Uh, at the end of the world, the soldier at some point perished. I don't know if he was killed off by the light or if he just died beforehand. But when Cyan came to her and found out that the girl hadn't heard of him, she something inside him snapped, and she. Uh, so he decided to start writing to her in behalf of the. In the name of the old soldier, because he saw something of himself in there. She, he didn't want her to experience the tragedy he had of losing his wife and child. Even though it was just a fantasy, she could never see him again. Dwayne and Katrin are both 16 and in love. Yeah, these two. And then a year later, Katrin is pregnant. So, teenage pregnancy, but somehow it got past the radar. Didn't edit that at all. That's where you first meet them, so all this becomes involved later on. Uh, so we're done. Now it's time to get the underwater breathing device. My two berserkers. He 
yeah, he fights like Yamaro. It's pretty interesting if uh, you start using, like, get the rage ring, which allows Yamaro to throw his companions. If uh, the the motion is of the game is only designed for Yamaro to do it, though, so. Uh, so it looks kind of weird. It basically whoever he would send fire to, so powerful. Whoever he would be sending flying, uh, just kind of charges. Looks like they charge on their own. But if uh, Yamaro is in the party, he actually causes Yamaro to do it, even though the person performing the action is, in this case, Gao or Minwu. I'm glad there are no encounters in here. So one of the uh, problems with this game is uh, with this, I mean with the setup that I'm not too appreciative of is how uh, they, they assign the randomness to everybody so everybody can be every class so Yamaro will have abilities and unless he ends up being Yamaro and Whoever the Berserker is can't use anything but Berserk, but there are certain things they weren't able to do, like, uh, essentially... <laughs> nice. But, uh, essentially, Yamaro and Gogo -Go cannot earn magic points or equip espers, and they couldn't figure out how to turn that on for them. So regardless of what happens, uh, Gogo -Go will only be able to use whatever magic of, you know, the, his mimic magic ability. Because he's a mimic, he only has the magic of whoever anybody else in the party has. And even though he might not be the mimic, he will still have that ability for some reason. This is dangerous, so I need to... Oh, thank you. They're really dangerous. They could kill me with their stupid clean sweep. Oosh. Okay, this cave is always skipped in... Uh, speedruns, because it's such a long thing going through these levels. But it has a powerful item in it that I want. Hopefully. Powerful. Cards. Who huh. can use cards? Battle Power 104 can be used by a mining cloud and cell. Not as good as the assassin though. Too bad. Okay, now we're here. So anyway, regardless of what abilities he has, Gogo's magic ability will only uh, be equal to everybody else's, you know, he'll, he'll have whatever those are. And uh, Yamaro cannot learn magic or spells, so they will instead give him an ability to replace magic with, but it's just it would work a lot better if they just were able to fix that, or if they couldn't, just leave those two characters as what they were. I think it's better that way, personally. But, uh, the Berserker and the Mind, the two greatest ones are not towards the end of the game. Those two are the ones that can equip Ninja Gear, and I've got a couple of them. Mages Hats, Silk Robes, um, but I have all those natural things, so I probably don't want that. You can actually equip a Mages Hat, even though you can't use... Well, actually, that would be good. Increase the power of his uh, Fire 2s, since you can do that. Ooh, Bandanas. That's actually better for him, too, but... Let's buy one. Actually, won't equip any of them right now, though. So basically, if either Yamaro or Gogo -Go does not get uh, Warring Goggles to your tent, don't want any of those, so time to go. Unless one of those two gets Berserk, you're basically left with three party members who can't learn normal magic, and two who can't cast normal spells, which is, in my opinion, very frustrating.
moved in your base so that everybody else can use the equipment. And okay, I'll do with this scenario. And I'll go ahead and end part two here. And until next time.